In this video I'm going to show you how I attach felt to the back of my rugs using a hot glue gun and adhesive spray. This is what the back of the rug looks like once I've cut it from the frame after allowing the latex to fully dry. So as you can see I tend to leave about 2 inches of backing fabric when I'm cutting the rug from the frame. This is because I'm going to fold over the backing fabric and glue it down with a hot glue gun which I'll show you later on in the video. In this step I'm just cutting slightly into the backing fabric so that it makes it lay flat when I fold it over and glue gun it. So you're going to need some hot glue gun sticks, a hot glue gun, something to press the fabric into place when you're gluing it down and a thick glove so that you don't burn your skin with the glue. As you can see here in the video I'm just applying a line of hot glue directly on top of the latex rug and pushing down the backing fabric into place. When using a hot glue gun, the glue dries in a matter of seconds, so just repeat this step the whole way around the rug. So then I'm just cutting away any loose parts of backing fabric that aren't stuck down, just to neaten the back of the rug a little bit. So I choose to back my rugs with felt that I buy from eBay, but if you can get hold of any anti-slip backing or anti-slip felt, that would work even better. You'll need to cut out a piece of felt that matches the dimensions of your rug. To do this I find it easier just to place the rug on top of the felt and trace around it with a biro pen. Take some sharp scissors and cut out the felt. Once you've cut out your felt backing, place it directly onto the back of the rug and it's time to apply it with an adhesive spray. So the next step involves using the contact spray adhesive to attach the felt to the back of the rug. So with this step you want to be outside to use the spray. So you probably should wear some form of protective equipment. I was wearing a glove so that it didn't get on my skin but I essentially should have been wearing some kind of breathing mask. So as you can see, I'm spraying the adhesive down the latex side of the rug and then I'll go ahead and press the felt and the back of the rug together. Repeat this process until you've covered the entire back of the rug in adhesive spray. I found that this 500ml bottle of adhesive spray was only enough to cover about two of these size rugs, so it does run out pretty quickly. <laughs> This is what the finished rug ended up looking like, so thank you for watching and I hope this video was useful.